Hi everyone, welcome to another Autodesk screencast by Zan Ta of Repo Products. This screencast will showcase how to create a power and or switch system electrical within Revit 2017. If you like this video and would like to see more, please search for Zan Ta or VAR2016. Thanks for watching. Here I am in Revit 2017 and I have a very basic model that I put together. It's nothing more than a couple walls, a ceiling, and some light fixtures, and a switch. I'm in the ceiling plan electrical view, and if I want to go ahead, I can select a light fixture. When I select the light fixture, you'll see in the contextual tab called Modified Lighting Fixtures, the ability to create a particular system, either a power or a switch system. Let's go ahead and start with the switch system. When I do this, I can click edit the switch system and add to the system other objects that make up that system. I can click them individually or just do a window crossing like this. I can choose select switch and pick that switch. When I'm finished, I click finish editing the system. If I put my mouse over a switch and hit the tab key, you'll notice that the switch system is actually created and configured properly and I can select it and you can see it. If I select the light fixture, <clears throat> I can also create a power system. So if I click power, it's going to again ask me to click edit circuit so I can add to the circuit other objects that make up that circuit. If I have an electrical panel family that I've already loaded and placed in here, I can choose that panel to tie to. Since I don't have one for now, I'm going to click Finish Editing the Circuit. Back over here, uh, let's go ahead and put in electrical equipment and put in a panel board. Uh, let's do 225 amp. Place it on the vertical face of the wall, say right here. And now if I select that light fixture, um, I can go back to the electrical circuit system and select the panel to tie back to. Now that that's finished, all I need to do is put my mouse over a light fixture and hit tab. And the, each time you hit tab, it will try to figure out what you're trying to select and eventually it will find that electrical circuit. So left click once and then you'll see this little icon here to create the arcs and it will therefore create the arcs. So this is how you create an electrical switch and an electrical power system for a very basic simple system in Revit 2017. Thank you very much for watching, and um, if you have any questions, contact us. Thank you.